today I will show you how to make the scrunchy Y2K effect. Yo, it's Povikas here and let's begin. Alright guys, so the first thing you'll want to do is press Ctrl Y to make a new adjustment layer. And now we can start adding effects. So the first effect I like to add here is S Glint. Now here I like to make the brightness to 0.5, the threshold to 0.92, threshold blur to 11 and the size to 334. Okay, that's looking pretty cool. And now we can add signal. Now this effect is very important for this look. What I like to do here is I like to make the signal amplification to 18. The color filter I like to make to 3, 4, 4, 8, 8. And also it's important to go to limo modulation, turn off tape errors, and also the turn on and off. And you will already have this crazy look. Now we can add uni dot VHS. First thing we can do is go to tape damage and just turn this to 1.1 and turn the pop line frequency completely off. We don't need it. And go to color controls. Here make black level to 12, saturation to 68, luminance blur to 19.8 and the color mix to 52. All right, that's looking great. Now we can add add grain. Uh, let's make the viewing mode to final output, the intensity to 3.3. Now let's add S flicker. Here I like to make the amplitude to like 0.275 I guess. And now let's add tint. Here let's go to color and I like to make it to purple here. Uh, you can make it whatever but that's just like the Y2K style. Press OK. Make the amount tint to 20%. Now let's add deep glow. Here we need to make the exposure to 0.07 and go to input and make the threshold to 60%. Now this is how it looked before and after. I really liked how, what deep glow does here. Now let's add S Tint. Here we can go back to map to white tool or and just copy this right here. Press Ctrl C, go back, ten lights, press Ctrl V, press OK. As you can see, that is very purple, so we actually want to press E and go to S tint. And here we go to compositing options and make the effect pass 25. And that's looking very good right now. Now we can add exposure. And here you can make it like depending on your clip, but I like to make it to 0.7 because you want to make it a bit more exposed. You know, it's kind of dark. Now we can add curves. And here I like to make one point here, one point here, and drag this a bit down and drag this a bit up. Yeah, something like that. Basically, here we already have the look. I think that looks super cool. Like this how it looks on other clips as well. This is how it looks on our clips. This is before, after, also before, after, just an insane effect. And what we can do is go to like one of the effects, press control A, go to animation, save animation preset. And here you can just call it like Y2 create grunge effect Povikas and press save on whatever, like you can call it whatever basically. And whenever you want to add this effect, you can type Y2K grunge effect Povikas and just add it and you will have it instantly. Now, if you guys want more of these Y2K type of effects for the Y2K aesthetic, my my great friend Pelly from Editing Visuals has actually made a Y2K FX pack where he has a lot of presets and some overlays there. So I actually kind of want to show you a couple of them. So if you press Ctrl Y and go to FX and presets and type Y2K, you will see this many presets if you actually have the pack. So you can just look through all of these effects and add whatever effects you want. Like I really like the pink Y2K glint. It's very nostalgic look, I would say. And yeah, this is just how it looks on the other effects. If you guys want those like really old Y2K looks, like you can go to here and add like black and white Y2K series. I really love this look. It really reminds me of like those Nolan edits. There are so many of these insane CRT ones, like the Y2K purple CRT is just insane for this look. Also kind of like a grungy uh, Y2K effect. And there are so many more of these presets that I would really recommend to check out. And there are also overlays included in this pack. This pack is on editingvisuals.com. And you can also save $5 off by using code POVICAS at the checkout on the Y2K FX pack. But anyways, guys, that's about it for the video. If you have any questions, then please let me know. But anyways, it was fun. Have a fun and productive day. See ya.